Uh, welcome everyone. Um, I'm going to go in back into the race spec Maserati series um, that I've got 35% um, so far off. Uh, what have we got here? I've got a couple of time trials. I? Obviously I'm going to be working towards the 50% uh, on this one. Uh, so I'm going to go into number 8. Uh, it's just come up, um, it's the just gone to midnight so I need a race that's going to be worth you know, worth doing for the double um, bonus stuff. So I'm going to go straight into the uh, Silverstone Grand Prix Circuit Cup. Should be a few uh, friends racing on this one now uh, through Google Plus. Uh, anyone connects with me on the Google Plus um, circles uh, now will be starting to appear on these uh, races. So if you uh, subscribe to the channel, or uh, or not as the case may be, if you um, go to uh, the Google Plus and add me onto your circles, then uh, you'll uh, start appearing in these videos as well. It's obviously going to be better when we're out of the um, these Maserati ones when I do the normal cars, because all your car liveries and stuff will show up as well. So if you've uh, painted your car or customise it whatever way uh, that will show up on here as well so it's a, it's a good way to sort of show your car off and I, I always look out for uh, cars with um, you know different uh, decent paintwork and vinyls and because there's some really really good cars out there I do like seeing what other people have done because it's good for, you know, we all get different, we all get some ideas off of each other uh, for our own cars. Obviously this one you can't do, um, can't do much with it. It's funny these special stage cars that you, um, the special events, you know, you spend sort of a week or so winning them and then once that's all done and dusted, you, you don't tend to race them that much afterwards. You do for a little while but then it's like everything else I suppose, you know, after novelty wears off a little bit. Oh, oh I'm only up to third. Oh, he's a bit, a bit nasty there, wasn't he? I'm only up to third in a, um, in a chase view. Well pleased with myself. Shows you, you try these things and you know you do certainly get better at it. I must admit, I actually prefer this view now to the hood view. Hood view, I can still drive the best. But this is a. seems to be getting a lot better than it was. I used to crash all the time in here. Well, I would make one suggestion if you use all use any of you watching this use assists turn them off and drive, drive properly because all this when you lose control of the car and stuff I mean that's all part of the game I think see to me <clears throat> to me I, I like the car to be as you know for a game anyway as realistic as it can be so if you're going to start if you're sliding all over the place and you end up crashing through sliding then you know that's that's your fault i don't want i don't want uh steering assists and brake assists and i don't even like traction control you know i have mine all turned off but i did that from the very first time when i first started playing the game so to me when i first started playing it was it was hard to stay on the track anyway, and that was with all the assists and everything they gave it. So I thought, well, if you can't stay on the track with all the assists, what's the point of uh, learning that? And then it's going to get harder and harder and harder. So. On uh, the next race, uh, well, actually, uh, any other videos from here, I'll um, put the avatars. Now I'm on Emiliano. I'll put, I'll put the avatars on so you can see your um, avatars as well. I forgot to do it on this one. So it depends what races I'm actually in. Uh, if I'm obviously not recording it, then I'd um, 
I don't have the avatars on. Uh, I have it in miles per hour, as you can see, which is what it's like here now. Uh, but for recording, I normally change it to kilometres an hour. So I know most of you use kilometres uh, more than miles per hour, and if it's endurance, you prefer metres to miles or kilometres, should I say? <clears throat> and obviously, uh, you having the avatar of yourself is a good thing for you to see. So. I will change that after this race. The last lap, I think I'm going to go into a uh, cockpit with you. I'll just stay behind it, Emiliano, a minute, and I'll chuck it into. Oh, I can start chuck it in a cockpit with you, but I've got a bend coming up. I'll try doing it while I'm going around the corner. Luciano being chased by the boy. Right, Emiliano, are you going to stop me winning this one or not? I need to win this really. Oh, it's only the third lap. I thought it was, uh, I thought it was on the last lap. Let's watch, the, uh, let's watch Emiliano, see what lines he's taking. Over to the right, come on, over you come. No, you could have a bit wider now. Tell you what, I was flat out right now, I only just slightly caught him, just even just a little tiny bit. Well, he's not gonna get this lead up easy, is he? Yeah, I finished the um, Ferrari, the first one, the 375, the other day. That was a really enjoyable uh, special event, I thought. That stage seven, I thought, was actually quite hard. There was one event on the first one was quite hard, and then the rest were all easy. And then stage seven, a couple of those, I thought, were pretty difficult. Right, see so how much money we're going to get for this little beaut. That's the end here, isn't it? Oh, no, it's not. I thought it was at the end. It's a long old track, this Grand Prix one. So I don't like, I don't like corner cutting. I like it to be as sort of, um, you know, as real as it can be, really. Must say this game is brilliant, isn't it? For an app, you know, it doesn't cost you a penny if you don't want it to. If you want to spend some money, you know, some you know real money and get buy gold and uh, get cars quicker and all that, then obviously you know go ahead and do it. Without you know without them uh, those people spending real money, I mean you know, a lot of us would never be able to play the game anyway. So fire monkeys obviously do uh, rely on people spending their real money to keep all the people um, making a game and stuff so if you're one of them good on you I'm sure we've all spent some sort of money on it so it's quite a good paying race um, for this as you go through the game I'm just going to show the uh, scores on the doors in case your name's um, on there to show how uh, well you did. So the best one there was Luciano, Emiliano. Chef hasn't got a uh, avatar for some reason. Smith seventy seven. What football ground's that? I can't see it quite clearly. It looks like a football ground. Let us know if you uh, if you're watching it. Right, what we got for the? Uh... Well, I need a service, so I'm just going to um, take the avatars off, and I'm going to do that head to head. 
uh, see which one of you are going to get picked um, for that. I think that puts us at 38% now. It's going to change that to, um, no, take me a second anyway, just to um, uh, metric and the avatar. Right, I'm just going to do this uh, head to head, all that needs a service. Just see which one of you is going to be the lucky one who's going to lose. Unlucky Erdem. My car needs a service. I've never lost a head to head yet. You look like you're deep in fault there on your avatar. You know, I don't really like the um, hood view much on this car, I must admit. I think since I've done that 375 Ferrari with the uh, cockpit view, it seems to have taken over my own preference now where I like to drive. I always thought hood view was the only way to go, but they're all good, aren't they? Just whatever you fancy at the time, really. The only trouble with cockpit views, you can't uh, see out very well sometimes. That the uh, pillars, like the A pillars, seem to restrict your view quite a lot. Tell you what, I can't catch him. You know, I'm still with a whip, but I can't catch him. Look in your mirrors, the guru is here. Put some pressure on the boy. How close I can keep up behind him. So I do sort of things like this. You know when you come to the um, the challenges, like that Ferrari, you have to stay within 50 yards or whatever. I mean, I do that just, just as part of mucking about with the game, really. Like it's, good, it's all good practice for when you get these events. You know, I also sort of push people off the track and uh, break their back windows, all that sort of stuff. Just as and then skid round a corner and that sort of stuff. But it's all good practice for when you get these events because you always seem to need them. Follow me, leader. I'll have to make sure I go past you know, before the end. In fact, I'm going to break his window. No, I'm not. Don't need to do that today. Oh, I'll let him get away a bit there. Bit near the end now. <coughs> One fucking win by. I was going to slow right down, but it might have me, so I better not. Put her into service. 